The Ukrainian ground forces have commenced testing of Leopard 1A5 tanks provided by international partners, marking a significant step in enhancing Ukraine's military capabilities. Lieutenant General Oleksandr Pavlyuk, commander of the Ukrainian ground forces, shared details of the ongoing tests on a combat course, noting that Ukrainian soldiers are praising the Leopard 1A5 as faster and more accurate compared to the Soviet-era T-64 and T-72 tanks that Ukraine has historically relied on. The tests are focused on improving the proficiency of Ukrainian tank crews, with driver mechanics practicing essential maneuvers designed to develop automatic reflexes. These exercises include pivoting on the spot, navigating narrow sections, overcoming mine explosive barriers, and ascending steep inclines without rolling back. These drills are crucial for the tank crews to adapt quickly to the Leopard 1A5's capabilities and ensure effective use in combat scenarios. The Leopard 1A5, developed in Germany and introduced in 1987, is a versatile and highly capable main battle tank. With a fully rotating turret, its four-person crew can engage targets from any direction, offering superior flexibility in dynamic combat situations. The tank's main gun has an elevation range from plus 20 degrees to minus 9 degrees, allowing it to operate effectively in varied terrain, including rugged environments and urban settings, where the ability to fire from elevated or depressed angles is vital. Despite its weight of 40 tons, the Leopard 1A5 retains impressive mobility and agility, essential for modern battlefield conditions where both offensive and defensive maneuvers are crucial. Its dimensions, 7.09 meters in length, 3.37 meters in width, and 2.76 meters in height, make it a robust vehicle capable of providing significant protection for its crew while maintaining battlefield effectiveness. Originally designed for the German Bundeswehr, the Leopard 1A5 has been exported to several countries, including Brazil, Greece, and most recently, Ukraine. Although the tank has been in service for decades, its proven performance and versatility continue to make it a valuable asset in modern warfare, particularly in Ukraine, where it is being deployed as part of ongoing efforts to bolster defense capabilities. Ukraine's acquisition of Leopard 1A5 tanks is part of a broader initiative supported by Germany, Denmark, and the Netherlands. During the Ramstein format meeting on September 6, 2024, German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius confirmed that Germany and Denmark had already delivered 58 Leopard 1A5 tanks to Ukraine. An additional 77 tanks are expected to be delivered soon as part of a joint effort with the Netherlands and Denmark, underscoring the international commitment to strengthening Ukraine's defense in the face of ongoing conflict. These deliveries, along with the comprehensive testing and training currently underway, reflect Ukraine's strategy to integrate Western military equipment into its forces effectively. The inclusion of Leopard 1A5 tanks, known for their precision, mobility, and versatility, is expected to enhance Ukraine's operational capacity on the battlefield, offering a significant upgrade over the older Soviet-era tanks that have been the mainstay of its armored forces. The introduction of Leopard 1A5 tanks into Ukraine's arsenal represents a major milestone in the country's efforts to modernize its military. By familiarizing Ukrainian crews with these advanced systems through rigorous testing and training, Ukraine aims to improve its readiness and effectiveness in combat. The Leopard 1A5's ability to engage armored targets with precision, combined with its superior mobility, provides a tactical advantage that is expected to play a crucial role in the ongoing conflict. As Ukraine continues to receive military support from its international partners, the Leopard 1A5 tests represent a tangible step towards strengthening the country's defense capabilities. The integration of these tanks into the Ukrainian ground forces is expected to contribute to enhanced operational success on the battlefield and further bolster Ukraine's ability to defend its sovereignty.